So, I think now the very important part is what is the role of an individual in prevention of pollution. See, we are all citizens of this country. Okay. I am teaching you, tomorrow you will go, you will become responsible citizens, engineers, working in various organizations. Okay. So, we are all having, what role we can play? So, it is uh, uh, the everybody's responsibility to contribute towards a better quality of our environment and human life. Okay. So, First thing is we should develop respect for all forms of life. As I am repeatedly saying, planet earth is not only for humans. So we have got all sorts of biodiversity, right from mammals, animals, cattle, reptiles, uh, aquatic life, marine life, okay, plants, trees, everything, uh, insects, fungi, everybody has a role to play in this. Secondly, we know that plants are the plants and trees are the main producers, primary producers of this ecosystem, and they produce oxygen also, which we are breathing freely. So we need to plant trees wherever we can, and more importantly, take care of them. They reduce air pollution. For every one person to survive on this planet, he requires at least seven trees, oxygen from seven trees. India has around twenty-eight trees per person whereas the good countries like Canada and all, uh, they have got around 10,000 trees per person. Not only that, 66% of Canada is having a forestry like green cover, whereas India hardly 22-25% of the total land is under green cover. So we need to increase the green cover by planting more trees. Reduce the use of wood and paper products wherever possible. So nowadays, as you know, CPWD, Central Public Works Department, they have stopped use of wood in all the government constructions. Because when you are using wood means again the trees are being cut. So we should avoid wood and now particle board is being used for all this new new generation furniture. And also paper products because for paper making paper also trees are being cut. Do not buy furniture, doors, window frames made from tropical hardwoods such as teak and mahogany. These are forest based. So normally we have all this furniture at home, sofa set, dining tables and all, made of teak wood, uh, rosewood, mahogany and all. So we should not use, now as I was telling you should use uh, particle based, particle board, which are, is, that is engineered wood, not a original wood. Okay. Reduce the use of fossil fuel by either walking up for short distance. Uh, using a carpool, sharing a bike or using public transport. This reduces air pollution. So, uh, when you are trying, see every month we have got some budget for our petrol charges, uh, diesel charges in the car and all. So, you should use it properly. Unnecessarily roaming around, loitering around with your bike or car doesn't make sense. So, need based you should be there. You are all edu educated people, technical people. So, you should understand that every liter of uh, uh, petrol burnt releases almost 3 kgs of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere. Every unit of electricity burnt which you consume it releases 1 kg of atmosphere, carbon dioxide into atmosphere. So we are responsible for this pollution but we are not able to see it. Shut off the lights and fans when not needed. So a very com simple common sense if you are not using lights and fans Please shut off and go. In classrooms also, when you leave the class, please put off and go. Even follow it at home also. Don't use aerosol spray products and commercial room air conditioner, uh, air fresheners. See, nowadays actually, uh, I think, now you have got ozone friendly products of late, they have come. But these old sprays, na, all these sprays and all, they are very dangerous. Air fresheners and all this. They damage the ozone layer so be careful but off late I have seen now ozone friendly eco friendly products have come instead of using uh, use and throw batteries use rechargeable batteries so that you can use them for a longer period otherwise it's all uh, use and throw batteries they also cause lot of pollution try to avoid asking for plastic carry bags 
सो बेटर कैरी योर ओन क्लोथ बैग हैव सम गुड क्लॉथ बैग और नाइलन बैग एंड कीप कैरिंग एंड डोंट इनक्रेज कैरिंग दिस वंस यूज प्लास्टिक कैरी बैग्स अवॉइड पेपर नैपकिस एंड गो फॉर स्पंजिस एंड वाशेबल क्लोथ नैपकिस डिश टॉवेल्स एंड हैंकर चिप्स इंस्टेड ऑफ पेपर नैपकिस सो डोंट यूज थ्रो वे पेपर एंड प्लास्टिक कप्स एंड कप्स वेन रीयूजबल ऑप्शन वर्शंस आर अवेलेबल सो वंस यूज मटेरियल ना लाइक प्लास्टिक प्लेट्स प्लास्टिक कप्स दिस शुड नॉट बी यूज यूज स्टील कप्स स्टील प्लेट्स यू कैन यूज दैम एन नंबर ऑफ टाइम वॉश एंड यूज रीसाइकल ऑल न्यूज पेपर्स ग्लास अलूमिनियम अदर आइटम्स एक्सेप्टेड फॉर रीसाइकलिंग इन एरिया सी यू आर सीन ऑल विलेजेस एंड ऑल द प्लेसेस दिस रद्दी फेलोज विल कम सो सेल द न्यूज पेपर टू दैम दे विल रीसाइकल इट even metal metals also some steel aluminium those people come and collect the material so that it is goes for re- recycling only not as a landfill and we can also have a compost bin in our garden or terrace and use it to produce manure for our plants to reduce the use of fertilizers so in every house you can whatever food is uh, wasted every day and the vegetables and uh, fruits that uh, लेफ्ट ओवर और पील्स ना दैट कैन बी यूज एज ए टू मेक कंपोस्ट इन योर हाउस दैट इज पॉसिबल एंड डू नॉट लिटर द रोड्स एंड सराउंडिंग्स प्लीज अंडरस्टैंड दैट एनवायरमेंट प्रोटेक्शन बिगिन्स विथ यू सो यू आर ए वेरी रिस्पॉन्सिबल पर्सन दैट इज वाई दिस टॉपिक हैज बीन इंक्लूडेड बिकॉज इट शुड नॉट बी ए स्टोरी टेलिंग बिजनेस पीपल शुड अंडरस्टैंड दिस एज आई वॉज टेलिंग टू मेंटेन दिस इको सिस्टम to make maintain this environment and all habitable for man we have to take care of the environment thank you